In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create saved workflow views. This helps you create saved views or reports based on the work that you want to quickly see. So inside Financial Sense, you have all these different filters that you can use to drill down your work. You can search by tag or status, due date, assignee, show current assignee, clients, client groups, or even work type with the search bar. Once you apply these filters, you can save these views. So for example, here I already have created several views like work in my queue, bookkeeping work due this week, tax work due this week, work on hold, high priority work, or my staff's work, or monthly bookkeeping and review, or even views for certain teams. So for example, maybe I want to see all the monthly bookkeeping work that's in review right now. I can apply that view and now it shows all that. Or maybe I want to now see all my high priority work. I don't have any. That's great. Or I want to see my tax work that's due this week. I can easily filter for that work. So how do you create these views? To create the view, first thing you're going to want to do is apply the filters. So maybe I want to see bookkeeping work, right? That is waiting on client information. Okay, I've now applied the filters. I can then create, save, and then create view or save as new view. I'm going to call it bookkeeping work waiting on clients. Hit save. And if I want to, I can also apply it as my default view. If I do this, now every time I log in, it's automatically going to display this view instead of my other view. So hit save. And now I have that view created. You can also edit views. So when I'm in this view, if I make a change, like maybe I just want to show stuff that's due this month, and then I hit save, I can, up, I can save those changes and edit my views. And that is how you can create save views in Financial Sense to quickly filter between and see the work that matters most to you.